YouTube, it's Echo Bear, and today I want to review an app that is like esteemed in the history of video games. It's Galaga. And why am I reviewing this? Since it's an old ancient arcade game, it's an app now for its 30th anniversary. And before I get through that, let's get to the serious stuff. If you guys don't know, Namco is the original publisher and developer of a lot of games such as Pac-Man, Galaga, and Tamagotchi. So that's awesome! They've moved over to the App Store, they're staying relevant and recreating a lot of beloved games, which is amazing and I enjoy it thoroughly. And just gonna point out, this app is a few years old, so the message is a little outdated, but still, it's still a lot of fun. Happy birthday, Galaga! July 23rd, 2011 marks the 30th anniversary of Namco's arcade shooting classic, Galaga. To commemorate the 30th anniversary, we redesigned and modernized remakes of all four titles in the Galaga series. Galaxian, Galaga Galapagos, aka Galaga 3, and Galaga 88, available now with one upgrade iOS application. So, so far in this game, you can play the original remake of the original game, Galaga. And if you put the two side by side, they look almost identical, except for a couple things here and there that update it and give it a newer, edgier feel which is a lot of fun to see an old classic getting new life breathed into it. Now, as far as I know, you have to purchase the other versions of the other few versions of it, but you can play the original for free. I haven't tried the others, so I'm just going to focus on the free one. Like I said earlier, it's the original game just with new updates. It, all of the sound effects are identical to the original game. The opening game noise, the sound effects of shooting, and sounds of explosions, and the invaders I'm in down. So that's really fun. It's super nostalgic, which I adore it for. It's so beautiful. Like, it's a classic. You can't mess with it. But what they did, they added in some background music to go along with it. Now, it is definitely modern, it's not 8-bit, it's definitely like fully realized electronic music, but that doesn't take away from the nostalgia of this game, which mainly I'm focusing on that because if there's a remake of a game, I want it to give me the same feeling as that game when I first played it when I was a little kid. So that nostalgia is such a big important thing for me. So I absolutely love it for that, and it makes me so happy to see that they've stuck to their roots and like just expanded on it. Now as far as gameplay, since you don't have the regular joystick and buttons to hit it with, your <clears throat> controls are swiping back and forth or just holding and moving back and forth on your phone screen. And you can either tap or hold down on the screen to shoot. And there is an ammo limitation on here, so unlike the arcane where you could just mash the button like mad and just rain hell upon your enemies, you have to kind of be sparing with your ammo and either let it charge up for a huge amount of spray, using it all up and having to wait longer to shoot enemies, which can be a hindrance, but it can also time it a lot better. So depending on which way you want to do it, you can do both and both are successful. So there's really not a lot to say about this app. It's really beautiful. It's an amazing callback to its roots. I enjoy it so, so much. It's so much fun. It makes me like want to go play the original arcade game again, like I did when I was a little kid. <laughs> so that's all I have for today, guys. Make sure you like and comment down below, hit subscribe, share the video, and please let me know what you guys want to see. I want to get feedback from you guys, and I want to know what you guys want to see. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! It's... dude, stop staring at me. I'm recording here. Like, mm. Dude staring at me as he's walking by. That is rude. I can see him through my window. Dude being rude.